Cool Chariot Rider here, and once again, I'm playing some more subterfuge. So, a few things have happened in the past 24 hours that are quite important. Mostly, it is the fact that Roadkill has resigned from the game. I guess me and Nojo combined were just too much, and he just couldn't handle it. But, for whatever reason, he resigned, which... It's sort of a shame, because I was sort of expecting this epic duel of master tacticians just unweaving our intricate plans and throwing out our specialists to mess with the other person in so many ways. And that didn't happen. Um, instead, I just sort of had to mop it all up. Which, I mean, like, it's good for winning. But it just doesn't feel as glorious as defeating your opponent in, like, a tactical 1v1, maybe even a 2v1, considering Nojo. But it didn't turn out that way. So, I'm going to take over all these outposts. I, I guess I can't complain that much. Um, but... I just wish it would have gone a little bit differently. Uh, but anyway, so we need to start talking about our next move. So, well actually first I'll get my um, specialist out of the way. So, for my previous specialist that I hired, I hired a um, navigator, which just allows me to change the course of a sub that the navigator is on. So, like, if I sent the navigator to Wallace, I could just tell it halfway there to turn around and go somewhere else. And it would do that. In fact, I might just leave that up just as a proof of concept. But, so, um... Anyway, let's also look at the um, future hire that I have. So, I have a lieutenant coming up, which... Sorry, I apologize. I just had a little bit of a cough there. Um, you probably won't even hear anything because I'll cut it out. So, it'll just hear... It'll just be a bit awkward because it'll just be like a few moments of silence. Followed by me apologizing for something I didn't even hear, but oh well. But so anyway, so um. Anyway, the lieutenant, that's what I was talking about. So the lieutenant itself is not super amazing. I mean, like, he destroys five drillers, which take it or leave it. But he also, um, mostly makes the subs travel 50% faster, which is quite nice. But what makes the lieutenant valuable is he can be promoted into a general, which a general, um, let me see if I can find the general. So the general, he destroys, so he has a global ability, which affects all my specialists. And he just makes it to where any specialist I have in combat anywhere will destroy 10 drillers automatically. Just no questions asked. Pop. 10 drillers gone. Which is quite nice. And because this ability is for all of my specialists. Well, at in one place. Oh. I apologize again. Just been coughing a bit. My throat's a bit dry, but I need to finish this recording. Okay. So anyway, so um So every time I have a specialist in combat, I just reduce the enemy and this effect can stack with multiple generals. And I get to apply their other effects. So if I had like something else, like say War Hero, which destroys 20 drillers, but it's just when itself is in combat, 
It'll just, it can destroy up to uh, 50 drillers if I have three generals out immediately, which is super bonkers. So I think the general is really, really good. Um, he also makes the pirate amazing as well because um, we well, could just send the pirate out to fight something that just has less than 10 drillers and it just automatically wins. It, it's, uh, it's awesome. So, anyway, we need to talk about my future plans. So, because I've gotten all these outposts, I'm going to have, I have the second most outposts in the game. I'm the guy, I'm doing terribly for reactors, though. But I'll be getting some more eventually. But, so, I need to f figure out something to do with all this territory I have. Which I'm thinking... Before I attack anyone else, I should set up a mine. Because then I can start getting an, um, Neptunium rolling in, and we can start having an endgame timer on this. Um, it might make me a bit of a target, though, so I might wait until someone else is drilled. It'll probably be the Corf Baller, which... Yeah. He'll, he'll probably drill soon. But so, after I've drilled my mine, I might wait a few days, reposition some drillers, and then attack Alonissi. Oh. I apologize so much. It's just the coughing is real. <clears throat> Okay. Anyway. But I will probably lay out my plans in more detail uh, once I start getting to that point. So, until then, um, this has been Chariot Rider. Ride on.